365 days ago, a small elementary school of 600 students in rural Arizona took a risk and embraced a transformational journey, a journey to change the way teachers taught and our students learned. We knew that the traditional model of teaching and learning at Coyote Springs was not preparing our students to be successful in the ever-changing 21st century world. Learning was not transferable, it was isolated and disconnected. This journey transformed learning from an isolated and disconnected event to a relevant and rigorous experience. This experience connected our students to their local and global communities. This is our transformed learning. As you stroll down the halls of Coyote Springs at nine o'clock on a Wednesday morning, you notice that something is different. The halls are empty and many of the classrooms are empty too. The students are not in their places with their bright, shiny faces. Where are they? In the school garden with a sixth grade teacher collaborating to determine which plants are ready to be harvested and which need to be replanted, or checking the levels on the harvest water tank and increasing the sustainability of our garden. Down the way, a group of students work with the landscape architect and the math teacher to create a map that will be used to plan the schoolyard habitat. To these students, nature is not something that exists in faraway places, unconnected to their lives and managed by experts. They're the leaders, the creators, and the critical thinkers. Fourth graders are taking a step back into ancient times, using mathematical calculations and knowledge of the movement of the sun and the North Star to build a functioning sundial. Students are building a pond. Did you know, before you put fish into the pond, the water needs to be between 60 and 80 degrees Fahrenheit, and you need to collect water samples and test for ammonia, nitrates, and check the pH balance. The students at Coyote Springs know. Over the hill at Watson Lake, a group of students are making a community connection by collecting water samples to determine the dissolved oxygen levels for the reintroduction of trout to the lake. Other students are creating diverse community ecosystems in their classrooms. Imagine sitting behind the cockpit of a small plane as a fifth grader taking control of the flight. The Wright Flight Program does just that for our students. Not only did they learn about navigation skills, they also learned about aviation history and the importance of setting goals. A local college opens their doors to our students and teach them, give them a glimpse of the future. They learn about 3D printers, they learn about robotics, even some specialized high-tech painting techniques. Out through the windows, you can see our children reading and writing poetry. Students are expressing their learning in so many creative ways. They share their music at community events. They even use dramatic role play to teach about American history. Here's a classroom with students. In it, fourth graders along with second graders wanted to learn a little bit more about our local native communities. So what did they do? They created a museum. That museum included a variety of pottery that they created as well as home structures. Amazing. If you listen to the, the chatter within our hallways, it's purposeful and a lot of learning is happening. Here we have our first and second graders exploring their wonders. Wonders that they're looking at through genius hour. Kindergartners became experts on pumpkins, investigating in as many different ways as their imagination would allow. They measured, they talked about it, and they even wrote a book. Next step, how do we get our susical characters on that train? The fourth graders create a PSA that airs on local TV to raise awareness of endangered species. In the cafeteria, a group of students collaborate with the school lunch staff to learn recycling and composting importance. Real world problems, real world solutions here at Coyote Springs. These are our students and teachers transformed in how they are teaching and learning. They are connected with their community, they are collaborating with each other and their local communities. They are communicating in ways that they never thought they could. Students are creating solutions to relevant problems that they never before saw as problems. They are critical thinking to see the world in ways they never before thought possible using a range of contemporary tools to prepare them to compete in a global technology driven world. Students are being prepared with the skills needed to be successful citizens in this ever changing 21st century world that we live in. Our students are going places and will change the world we all live in. 
Students' bright, shiny faces are in diverse places in their school habitat, in the maker space, and communities. You don't have to pinch yourself. It is not a dream. It is 21st century learning, and it is happening at Coyote Springs Elementary School. Something, Something is, is different. different.